can we put some mud? Uh-huh. So that we can put it in this thing. Okay. Good. Okay. Really Alright, now you can start putting it in here. It feels like a sponge to me. Perfect. It should feel like a wet sponge. Okay, so you could just pour it like go like this. Oh, like that. Okay, now, once you guys think that we have it all full, does that look okay? Ready? Watch. That's not full. Does that look full? <laughs> Keep filling. Who wants to bounce it? Me. Okay, Sadie first, then Shay. Bounce it. Okay, now Shay, bounce it. Okay, do we look full? No. All right, keep going. <laughs> this is gonna be so good. Ah! Hey, watch out, watch out. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to our garden. Today I am in the garden with the girls and we are going, what are we gonna do? Planting vegetable seeds. Planting vegetable seeds. So the goal for this year was to get the girls a little bit more involved in gardening, specifically veggie gardening, so that we can one, get you guys to start, learn to start growing your own food. And then two, what are we gonna do after we grow the vegetables? We're gonna eat them. We're gonna eat them. <laughs> Are you gonna eat the tomatoes, Shay? No. Shay doesn't like tomatoes. <laughs> but she might like some of these that we got. So we wanted to say thank you to Proven Winners for sending us these fabulous seeds. So do you wanna talk about the ones that we got? So this is Dragon's Tongue. Dragon's Tongue Bush Bean right? Uh -huh. And they are purple and yellow. And then after they cook, the purple magically disappears. Did you know that? No. Cool, huh? Yeah. Where else do you, Shay, where else do you want to sow the dragon's tongue beans? In our fairy gardens. In our fairy gardens, right? And then we have this one. It's pesto basil. Pesto besto, right? Wow. So it's, it's basil, just like you said. And then we have three kinds of tomatoes that Shay's going to try. What, right? We have Garden Gem, Good Hearted, and Bellini. And what's, what's special about the Good Hearted? Because it looks like hearts. Because when you cut it in half, it looks like a heart. That's right. So we're going to plant these, we're going to sow these, and then we're going to try them later on this season, right? Yeah. Okay, so we already got the dragon's tongue bush beans sewn already, and so now we're going to open these up and then we'll get the tags. So why don't you open that one? Okay, okay. you open the Bellini. Oh, these are tiny seeds. They are. So on the back of the tag, it will tell you all the information. It'll tell you how many days it takes to germinate, which is, do you know what that means? No. That means when the seed opens up and the leaves oh. start coming. How many days it takes to harvest. So pesto besto is 65 to 72 days to harvest. And then it says planting depth. And what is that? Like four. One fourth of an inch, right? Mm. So that's probably just this big. Okay, and then you can take these, make sure they don't blow away, and you can kind of pour some. So like, do I take some or like pour some? How about you pour some in your hand? Hold your hands That's open. perfect, I used all of the seeds. Perfect. Okay, so look on the back of the tag so you guys can see how deep you have to plant it. I'll say planting depth. Uh, oh, it's one to about four. as, it's um, the same four. as the basil. Okay, so a quarter inch. So look, look, that's about this, right? So about there, like that. Big. Yeah, perfect. Good job. Okay, so Sadie, you can spray mm -hmm. to kind of saturate them. And then Shay, can you tell everybody the varieties that we sowed today? Yeah, pesto, pesto, basil. Cool. Good hearted tomato. Good. Garden gem tomato. Good. Bellini to tomato. And dragon's tongue, tongue bush bean. Perfect. Okay, so yeah. the Bellini tomatoes is indeterminate. Guess how tall that's going to get? Oh, as tall as me. As tall as you. <laughs> Probably taller than you. Probably taller than Sadie, too. So we're going <laughs> to have. Taller than you. 
I don't know. Maybe. maybe. Probably. Maybe. If, it, if it's taller really, than daddy. Maybe taller than daddy. We'll see. It's going to okay. grow into a tree. Oh, maybe. It might grow into a tree. Do you think we'll have enough room? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what do you have in your hand? Dragon's tongue bush beans. And what do you want to do with the dragon's tongue bush beans? Put them in our fairy garden. Okay, let's go to the fairy garden so we can sow the dragon's tongue bush beans. you got yeah. for Valentine's Day and St. Patrick's Day? So this is what we got for St. Patrick's Day. It's we got a little clover shamrocks mm -hmm. and also this one hat. Cute, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright, where should we plant the dragon's tongue bush bean? Uh, for is it back here? Yeah. For Valentine's though we got these glittery hearts. Cute, very cute. Okay, so dragon's tongue bush bean only needs to go one inch down, right? Yes. Sadie, show me an inch. An inch is about like... Uh, about half of that. Half. About half of that. Can you make a hole with your finger? About an inch Sadie down. I was thinking of two inches. <laughs> Sadie was thinking of two inches, yeah. Perfect. Okay, Shay, do you want to put the bush bean in? All three? Oh, sure. Well, then it's going to get like really tall maybe. Well, we can thin, if more come up, we can thin them, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, put them down. And this spot has irrigation already. Yeah, so that's good. All right. Now we have one less thing to do. Now we have one less thing to worry about. All right, what do you guys think? Good. Good. All right, so that was a fun day of sowing seeds with the girls. Thank you again to Proven Winners for providing us with those seeds. We're really excited about them, especially what, the good hearted? Mm -hmm. The good hearted and, and, the, dragon's and the dragon's tongue I'm ones. Mostly Perfect. Excited for the dragons. You're mostly excited for the dragon's tongue. Are you going to eat the dragon's tongue beans? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right, if you guys enjoyed this, please consider subscribing, and I hope you all have a chance to get into your garden today.